Well, when eTalk Daily got word that Queer as Folk was ending its run, we were the first on set to talk with one of TV's most frank and fearless cast. Be Mark. With 83 one-hour episodes of drama filmed in the 416, these primetime players sure are experts on the T dot. I love the beaches, and I just love the whole city. It's, it's very, very cosmopolitan, a very sophisticated city, but the, there's a gentleness to it here. That, like New York doesn't have, or Los Angeles doesn't have. The, the amazing thing about Canada is, and this is something you have to understand coming from Los Angeles, is that you guys shut down Queen Street in the summertime for a book fair. That's like shutting down Melrose in L.A., or, it's insane. But the way these stars perceive their home has changed significantly since Queer as Folk began production. We were here during September 11th, and being able to sort of experience the events that have happened over the past five years from a more international perspective, not being diluted with the American news media over the past five years, and being able to see it with a slightly more objective eye has sort of changed the way that I look at my country and uh, foreign policy. Another great thing about being in Canada is uh, the environment, the climate, the social climate, the reduced fear level in the street. <laughs> and there are Canadian fingerprints all over this show. We've worked with all these incredible Canadian film directors that have, have sort of infused the show with their own sensibilities, their own sort of renegade, offbeat, left the center, ideas and, and energy. Who did this? I'm Demented Queen. Oh no taste. Nice job, Ma. And what has this cast member saying bonjour? My boyfriend. He's a darling Montreal man and I just don't know. And even though this series is wrapping up, this unconventional family plans on staying in touch. I throw a monthly cast poker party here in Toronto. I've made that promise to myself. I'm not going to let it rip.